All right, so this is how you mod a new 2DS Excel. So first of all, make sure you are on the latest version, which is 11.17.0-50. The J or E or U you have does not matter. This is just region, and it does not matter what region you have. Then you're going to go into Mi right here. Ignore that it's Japanese. As I said, it does not matter what region it is. Mine is Japanese. Your, yours can be European, American does not matter at all. Just press whatever I press. Boom. And let this just load inside of me. And then you can just go out. Do not need to do anything else. Boom. Now you can power it off. And then you can take out the SD card out of it. Plug it into your PC with a SD card adapter. And boom, now it is plugged in. So here you have your folder. And what you're gonna do now is go into the first link in the description and you're going to download all of these files here. So I'm gonna just press on a download. Download as a zip file. Give this a second to download. Uh, 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 there we go, 16.6 megabytes. To open this, open that, and take all of these files right here and put them on the root of your SD card, not inside of any folder. On the root here. So they will all load here on the root of the SD card. Give it a second to load here. Mm -hmm. Now you will go on to mset9.bat, then press two for new 3ds and then press one to perform sanity checks and here i got an error which is totally normal I'll just zoom in here it will most likely get the same error if you do not skip this step i have seen people ask me exactly here even if i say skip this step they still try to do the step and then they it doesn't work for them because as I said, skip this step if you did not get these errors. But if you also got these errors, as I did, I'm gonna press enter. I'm gonna take out the SD card. Let's zoom out now. Plug it into your 2DS. There we go, it's in right. Now it's on. Gonna power it on. Just give it a second to turn on, and then you're going to go into settings, where settings, there we go. Gonna go into settings. Then you're going to press on here, Nintendo 3DS, and press on the second one right here. Nope, that's wrong. I'm gonna go back and press on the top one. And boom, I'm gonna press that. Okay, and boom. Now you can go out of here again and turn off your 3DS. Boom, turn off your 3DS, and we're gonna go back to the computer. So take out your SD card and plug it into the SD card adapter. There we go. And let's go back to the PC. Yeah, I had a parental uh, lock, so I had to delete that. And my SD card did not get detected. And boom, now it did. So now I'm gonna press on mset9.bat once again. I'm gonna press on two. And here we're going to in, uh, perform sanity check again. So press one, everything appears to be functional. Enter, I'm gonna close this out. Take out the SD card out of your PC and plug it into your 2DS. Now I'm gonna turn it on. And let's see here. Boom, open settings. Now open here, then Nintendo 3DS, and you're going to press on the second one here. Boom. Now take out your SD card while it's still on. Do not take it out. 
plug it into your PC. There we go. I'm gonna open mset9.bat, press on two, and insert mset9 payload, so two again. Let this do its thing. What is going on with my camera? There we go. And boom, it's done. Gonna press enter, take out the SD card, plug it back into the 2DS. And boom, now it's doing this thing. If you still get a loading thing, try to go back. If it still does not work, just delete the mset9 file and uh, and reinstall it after performing a sanity check so yeah i'm here which means it was successful and now press or follow whatever it says on the screen and then a to end it off it's going to do a simple backup which is really fast and boom now boom you're gonna come here and press start and uh, yeah, now I'll just change the language on it real quick before, before I continue, because this is a Japanese console, so I'm just going to change the language. And then we can continue to installing the homebrew apps. You are not done yet. And boom, now it's in English. So what you're going to do now is go all the way to the right here until you see download play. You're going to press on that. And then you're going to press down on your D-pad L and select all at the same time. And then you're going to go down until you see miscellaneous options, press A. Switch the HB, press A. Operation succeeded. And then you're going to press B, B and B. Press home. And then you can just X out of that and open it again. And this is now going to open the Homebrew Launcher. There we go. So now we're going to press on FBI, press A on SD, go all the way down to CIAs, press A, and cur on current directory, press A, and install and delete all CIAs, and A. Give this a second to download all of the apps, and this of course downloads Checkpoint, FBI, the Universal Updater, Homebrew Launcher, so you don't have to open it like this all the way. And uh, yeah, all the necessary apps. And there we go. And that's really it. Boom. And now you have a Mod 3DS. And here you have all of the gifts with the apps. So that's how you do that. Now, if you're wondering how to install HOP on your Mod 3DS, I'll put that right here. If you're wondering how to install DS games on your Mod 3DS, I'll leave that right there. And this is how you install Game Boy games on your Mod 3DS. Thank you for watching. Like, dislike, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.